Hey, Jesse, check this out. And three, two, one, pop! <laughs> Pretty cool, right? You can try it too Duck! if you... Working way too hard. You're always looking to one up us, aren't you? That is one seriously cool temple. Yeah, points for Ivor, I guess. This was a good tip. Well, Jesse? So, are we doing this? Order of the Stone, let's get some treasure. Treasure! So much for treasure. This cupboard is bare. Come on, you know how these places work. The treasure's never just out in the open. Let's fan out and search the place. Petra. Who's Petra? <laughs> Kidding. So, how are you feeling lately? Memory's all back, as far as I can tell. Now I'm just trying to get used to having teammates and people who worry about me. That's pretty new for me. It's nice, though. Thoughts on this place? I think I'd rather be in a straight fight than doing all this switch-pulling stuff. But I'm glad Ivor's intel about this place was good. How do you think Ivor knew about this place? Eh, who knows? That guy's read, like, a million books and traveled all over the world. You probably start to learn a thing or two about a thing or two. Okay, I'm gonna keep trying to solve this. Hey, Olivia. Yeah? Okay, I'm gonna figure this out. Never doubted you for a minute. What's up? Any ideas for how to fix this? Well, these channels of lava are blocked in strategic locations by those sticky pistons. Unblock them, and I'm guessing something cool will happen. So, what kind of treasure do you hope we find in here? Well, I've been working on a build that could use another couple dispensers, but some cocoa beans would be cool, too. So, have you been having a good time hunting for treasure? If you had asked me a couple of months ago, I would never have thought I would like all this adventuring and treasure hunting stuff. But this has actually been a really good time, and I've been getting lots of great stuff to build with. Okay, I'm gonna figure this out. Never doubted you for a minute. Blocked again! Never mind.
getting somewhere. disappointed if the floor didn't open up into a dark, creepy passageway. This kind of reminds me of when we first found the Order's temple. We were such a scared bunch of noobs back then. Hey, I wasn't scared. No? Then who was it that was yelling? Wow, yeah, that feels like it was, I don't know, a million years ago. We packed a lot in since then. And to think... That was just the beginning. Yeah, I mean, that was before we'd fought winter storms, hung out with Enderman, reunited the Order. So crazy. Bingo! All right, let's see what we've got. Reminds me of that time when you got a cake from that witch's hut, and I was super jealous of you. It's just, I really love cake. My mouth is practically watering just looking at it. Right? Cake is the best! It's totally my favorite. Or a top three, at least. You've got discerning taste, Jesse. I respect that. Huh! A pumpkin, not bad. I suppose that could be useful if we run into Enderman. And looks like we've got one more thing in here. It's... What did you find? What are you guys talking about? Whoa, that's super cool. I've never seen flint and steel like that before. That glow. Is it some sort of enchantment? I don't know. I've seen people put an unbreaking enchantment on a flint and steel before, but that's not unbreaking. You could give it a shot and find out. Okay, flint and steel, do your thing. Well, I have definitely never seen flint and steel do that before. Uh-oh. Like some monsters have a death wish. So what's the plan? If you ask me, it seems like a good time for a secret handshake. Yeah, so let's use the redstone wrap. Obviously. Uh, Warrior whip, go! Come on, Jesse. Make it good. Just like... <laughs> you guys, that was amazing! Okay, okay. It wasn't bad.
Man, this is becoming like my lucky sword. Oh no! Come on, dude, let's get you out of here. I tell you guys, doing that never gets old. Woo! Yeah, not too bad. Killing a bunch of monsters, getting sweet treasure. Like that flint and steel thing? You gotta try it again. I'd be curious to see it again, too. I'm dying to know how it works. I'm good. You can give it a shot, though. <laughs> Well, well. Where'd you get the new toy? Order of the losers. Yeah, losers. Ugh, who let you guys out of your cave? Joke's on you, we don't live in a cave. Well, well, well. It isn't Aiden and the Pussycats. That's not our name. So what are you... Ocelots doing here anyway. The Ocelots were Lucas's gang. We ditched that name just like we ditched him. Yeah, we rebranded. We're the Blaze Rods now. Blaze Rods! Shut up, Gil. Sorry, boss. Wow, you guys are terrible at naming. That's a dumb name. <laughs> Says the heroes that just called their group the New Order of the Stone. And where's Lucas, huh? The minute the Order decided you were cool... For whatever reason... He wouldn't stop sniffing around you like a tame dog. You take that back! Mmm... No. Hey, Lucas is ten times the guy you are. Yeah, Lucas is a hero. There's more than I can say for any of you creeps. You probably think that thing makes you so special. Classic Jesse. You take all the best stuff and never give anyone else a chance. That should have been ours. Oh, yeah? Yeah. Blaze Rods. Hey, we earned this, all right? Fair and square. Yeah, we fought monsters, lava, and levers to get this thing, and we ain't giving it up. <laughs> Nothing you've ever done has been fair and square, Jesse. Hand over the flint and steel, Jesse. Don't make me ask again. You don't get that one. It's supposed to be mine. <gasps> Some hero you are, Jesse. <sighs> Fine. What hope do we have when heroes like you are throwing your weight around like this? It's not always going to be this way, no. Come on, you guys. Let's get out of here. Blaze Rods! Ooh, I told you to shut up! Look out, Jesse. I don't remember him being that angry before. Wow, they scared easy, didn't they? Not easy enough for my taste. We should be careful. He seems different, scarier. Man, and all because he wanted that flint and steel. What are you gonna do with it? Ivor's the one that told us about this temple. He might know something about it. Hopefully Ivor can tell us more about it. Finally starting to recognize stuff again. Feels good to almost be home. Cheers to that, friend. I just can't shake what Aiden was saying about us back there. We do get a lot of treasure. And I guess sometimes we might throw our weight around. What? No. Aiden's got a bad case of treasure envy, pure and simple. I don't know. Yeah, not our fault we're so awesome. I guess so. Well, no matter what Aiden thinks, there's one thing I know. What's that? 
They think we're awesome. They're back! You guys, they're back! Run! Tell everyone that our heroes have returned! <laughs> yep, New Order of the Stone is back in town. to see us scream. Wow, that's new. It somehow manages to evoke skulls and tentacles. While still doing the whole barfing lava thing. Yeesh. Oh, that thing looks completely dangerous. Eh, not my fault! Look out! Oh, uh, help! Oh, stop your whining! What are your pathetic injuries in comparison to my majestic tower? Ivor? <sighs> of course. Oh, Jesse, you're back! Don't listen to a word these fools tell you. It's a fire hazard! And your face is an ugly hazard! So I suppose we're even. So what's this weird structure? It's my new house, and also, uh, my gift to the community. If anyone's short on lava, this is the place to get more! <laughs> you're welcome! Jesse, all I wanted was what any man wants. A little house of my own, with loads of lava pouring off it. Ivor, I know you mean well, but your house wants to kill people. Dude, you made a killer house. Exactly! Killer! Shut up! What about just moving it someplace else? I'm sure- Move it? Way more lava is going to spill out if we do that. Well? We have to tear it down. We can't let that monstrosity stand. It's my house, Jesse. I have just as much a right to build something as all these people, don't I? I'm sorry, Ivor, but your house is way too much of a hazard to the community. Tear it down, everyone. Good call. Ah, it's a slippery slope, Jesse. Today, the lava house. Tomorrow. Who knows what kind of rules you'll be imposing? Don't be a sore loser, Ivor. <laughs> I haven't seen you around in a while. So what can I do for you? Hey, um, sorry about your house. Oh, now you're sorry? I'm sorry that I live in a time where people don't appreciate true genius! Ah, would you get over yourself already so Jesse can show you what we found in the jungle? What? You did? <laughs> yes! Great to see you again! Let's do lunch! I'll bring the carrots! There's no telling who's listening. Meet me in the treasure room. Ten minutes. And bring the thing you found! Well, if we're gonna tear this down, we better start getting some buckets together to scoop up all the lava. You got any iron? Oh man, no. I'm all out. <sighs> okay. We better go mine some more. We'll catch up with you later. Yeah, once we give this majestic house the funeral it deserves. Sounds good. I'll see you guys soon. Later, guys! Come on, let's go find Ivor. This place is really shaping up. Whoa! Lucas! I don't believe it! Hey! You guys are back! How, uh... <laughs> how's it going? Lucas, really. It's great to see you again. 
Hey, you came back. Yeah, I thought I'd show my face again. Well, it's great to see it. Your face, I mean. Jesse, listen. I'm not gonna beat around the bush here. The last time we saw each other, with the ocelots and the wither storm and everything, I'm not happy about how things went down, and, well, I want to patch things up. I'm tired of us not talking to each other, so... I'm sorry. It was a stressful time, Lucas. I get it. It's so cool you came back. It's, uh... <laughs> Feels good to be back. Oh, wow. You framed it. I'm him. Yeah. How are you doing? I really, really miss him. Every morning I wake up and just for a minute, I can pretend that he's just in another room or rooting around outside looking for carrots. And then every morning I get to remember all over that he's gone. I'm so sorry. <sighs> okay, guys. I promise I wasn't just here to bum everybody out. I actually came back because I need to tell you something. It's about this weird run-in I had with Aiden. Ugh, I hate that guy. Whatever you said or did, it really got to him. Oh, great. And what did he have to say? Apparently, someone told him about Ivor giving you a tip, some kind of treasure. He really wanted to find it first. Ha! Beat him. He's just been so jealous of you and the rest of the Order ever since you saved the world from the Witherstorm. He's convinced that he was supposed to be a hero. Ever since he took over the Ocelot, the Blaze Rods, it just seems like he's gotten meaner. He's pushing Maya and Gil around. Aiden's a stupid bully. He doesn't scare me. Yeah, that's what I used to say, too. But he's been freaking me out lately. He got super aggressive. He demanded to know what treasure you were after next. So what'd you find that got Aiden so excited, anyway? Check it out. Wow. What a weird glow. Yeah, I know. I'm supposed to show it to... You found it! Yeah! Whoa! Dude, what's wrong with you? This is the greatest find of our time. I can't believe you're actually... That you're actually holding this. Okay, Spill, what's it do? It proves what I've always suspected. That glow, that enchantment, is the work of a very old group of builders. A group so old that they existed even before the Order of the Stone. Whoa. Yeah. Dramatic. Right? Wow, so that temple we went to? Was that built by these old builders? That's my suspicion. But it's what's inside the temple that interests me even more! You see, if these builders truly existed, and if you found their temple, that means we're one step closer to finding the Eversource! What a beautiful sight! Looks like you came back just in time, Lucas. More powerful artifacts, huh? The ever... what now? The Eversource! Are you, uh, gonna actually explain it any more than that? The Eversource is said to be an object of incredible power possessed by the old builders. It was some sort of treasure or artifact that gave them an endless supply of precious materials. Think about it, Jesse. That temple must have been its hiding place! Wow. Old builders? You learn something new every day. I'm still just trying to wrap my head around the Eversource. Wait, like the temple we just got back from? We have to go back there? Yes! Luckily, you already know the way! He does have a point. Old builders, ever sources, ancient mysteries. You know I'm in. Excellent! I'll pack my adventuring things immediately. Wait, he's coming? Wow, sounds like you guys have a lot to get to. I, uh, guess I'll take off? Nope, you're coming with. I need a buffer between me and Ivor. Let's get moving! <laughs> Adventure! Lucas, I know it's daytime, but watch our backs, okay? I can't believe we're bringing Ivor with us. 
I mean, it's nice that he's so excited, but oh, not my top choice for adventuring companion. Oh, come on. He's super funny and he makes me laugh. I guess. These trees are enormous. I love it so much. <sighs> he just really gets on my nerves sometimes. Remarkable. Look at this architecture. So old. So exquisite. Oh, this is just how I dreamed it would be. Ivor, it's nice to see you smiling. I'm not smiling. Wow, it looks so different during the day. Okay, but careful what you touch. There could be traps everywhere. Petra, blonde guy, are you two as excited as I am? I'm not sure that's possible. What? She means that you just seem to be super excited, Ivor. Huh. Doesn't look like those lava channels work anymore. I can't believe we missed some sort of secret area here last night. Eh, uh, we were kind of fighting, oh, a ton of monsters. It's not surprising that we didn't hit every single nook and cranny. You look excited, Ivor. Excited? I'm ecstatic. Thrilled! Overjoyed! The Eversource could finally be within my grasp! Once, sir. Uh, once we find it, that is. Pretty cool temple, right? Yeah, it's amazing. I'm not gonna lie to you, Jesse, I'm pretty excited to be along for the ride on this one. Barely got out of there last night. Doesn't look like it's opening up again anytime soon. That's all right. I had enough of the spiders and lava and everything that had to offer already. Well, that wasn't there last night. That looks promising. I'm heading up. Fantastic! We'll follow right behind you! Uh, yeah. What he said. So you think this Eversource thing is up here? Hard to say, Jesse. As the story goes, the old builders feared its potential. So they hid it away in a place where it would never be found. And ha! It never has been! What is Jesse doing up there? Well, that seems promising. Jesse! What do you see? <gasps> Some kind of portal? It's just as I'd imagined. Spectacular.
Ivor, I was just thinking, maybe that treasure... The Eversource. Yeah, that. Maybe those old dudes hid it in a portal. Ha! Hiding something in a portal. I like it. That makes a lot of sense. Here goes nothing. Oh, thanks for bringing this back to me, Jesse. I knew you were good for something. You're gonna regret that, Aiden. Oh, yeah? Yeah. Oh, yeah? Shut up, Gil! Step aside, Jesse. We're heading through that portal now. Oh, no way! Aiden, you're done. This is where it ends. Fine. Blaze rods! Clear me a path. Eversource, who knows what trouble they'll cause? Yeah, we're going, because I'm gonna get that Eversource first. Come on! Uh, that's what I like to hear. 